This is Tulsa Roach Exterminator. And uh, we're coming to you with another video um, at a customer's house we're about to perform work on. And we wanted to give a shoot a video about the top five places where you find roaches the most. So, and I'm going to do it from five to one. The, so, the least to the most. Now, granted, these areas are mostly always in the kitchen because kitchens has everything they need. They need shelter, food, and moisture. And the kitchen can provide that. So, with my experience, I found that roaches are hanging out um, in the kitchen mostly. So, so sorry, I'm moving this camera all around. But these are the five places you find the ro roaches the most. So the first, the fifth place, the fifth most place you'll find them is the top cabinets. And usually, you don't see a lot of roaches now because uh, the daytime roaches are nocturnal. So usually you find them a lot at the hinges. Now here, you can find a lot of roach poop, feces. So top cabinets, you can see in the edge. Uh, let me try to zoom in. Always in the corners and the edges. It's not letting me zoom in anymore. Um, so, but you can see the feces on this house um, where the roaches can have been you know and we'll come out and hang out you know once everybody goes to bed and once you know the lights are off for a long period of time the the top cabinet is number five so number four the top the place the fourth place where roaches like to hang out the most is the bottom cabinets now sometimes people don't put much stuff in the bottom cabinets, but because they're not open as much as the top and because they um, have less stuff is, this is a, a place that they will live and hang out and then come to the top to find food. So, because usually the bottom is where uh, you have pots and pans and then kitchen items that you don't use as much. So this is a place where it's dark more, more so they're hanging out and harvesting in these areas more. So, yes, the bottom cabinet. And I don't know if you can see, but again, the edges, they like to hang out where their body can be touching more than one side. So they like to hang out on the edges of the doors and just kind of hang out at the bottom. And there's a lot of cracks and crevices where places where they can hang out. And so we'll flush those out here in a minute and get the ones. There's a lot of cracks and crevices around here. So and there's a lot of moisture right here that's, that's perfect. So this is a place where they'll just kind of hang out and reproduce quicker because they have more options of food and a harvesting and moisture again. All right. So, so again, the bottom cabinets is the fourth place we found them. So the third is behind the oven and inside the oven. So, so there's a way we can flush the roaches out of the oven and kind of make it uncomfortable for them to be in but you know this is uh, uh oven provides warmth which they love warmth and so they will hang out inside and of course not next to the fire and not close to the fire but far enough where they're just warm and they can just hang out from danger um so after Usually while the oven's on, they might not be in it, but once it cuts off and once it cools a little bit, that, that's a perfect place for them to hang out 
uh, raise their family, whatever, um, behind because, of course, most people never move their um, oven very often other than just opening the door. You know, there's the place where they love to hang out would be um, is behind on the sides and then under the um, the oven. Fun fact, this part down here and in their oven, their part, it doesn't even open. This, this drawer down here for ovens, this was meant to be like a cooling area for food when they started making ovens. The problem with that is, is that that's great keeping your food down there, but for me, I feel like I would forget or sometimes the pests, if you have a pest problem, that's just the easy meal for them to get to. So people don't really use this a lot. They use it to store pots and pans, but that's what it was intentionally meant, meant for um, um, when, when they first designed stoves. So anyway, uh, this is a perfect place. There's always a lot of food particles around the oven, inside the oven. So once it cools, you know, that's their meal. Um, easy meal. You know, roaches, they don't travel far. They try not to travel far. They don't, if they don't have to, to get a meal. And they don't need much to survive. Um, so yeah, so that is the third place. And there's got a roach coming out right now. Um, uh, that third, the third place is the, the, um, oven, again, the oven. All right. The, the second place where you find roaches the most is under the sink, usually next to the dishwasher. Now, of course, the reason we say under the sink is because there's usually, if there's any moisture in the kitchen, it's usually in the sink area. And so it's just an easy access to moisture. So when I say the sink and the dishwasher, of course they hang around the dishwasher. There's a lots of areas where roaches can't, um, where roaches can't get, where humans can't get to. So it's a perfect place for roaches. There's a little, in, um, a little sliver where you can see in here, um, and they hang out in there. They hang behind again because there's warmth there. They love warmth uh, to stay warm. So, so great. The, uh, that, and then, of course, there's moisture hanging around under the sink. And then there's always a gap. And there's tons of usually gaps around here because of piping and, and um, plumbing. So they can kind of travel from getting food to going back into an area that's safe. So up here is might be condensation. And food particles, just easy food to get to, um, and easy moisture to get to, and then go back into harvesting areas. So that is the second place, the second most place that you'll find roaches at. And of course, you don't open this, you don't, you know, where they hide, um, which is under the underneath the uh, the floorboard of the sink. That is a place where they can be safe and even if you open the drawer that they're, they're still able to they're still able to hang, um, hang out and uh, be safe because they're not where they can be seen uh, which is under the floorboard or under the 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 flooring of the of the cabinet. So anyway, so number one, drum roll please, is behind the refrigerator. So behind the refrigerator is the perfect place because the refrigerator never moves and the motor at the bottom creates a um, creates condensation because of the compressor and so there's plenty of condensation. It's always warm because the motor is always warm and it's never too hot and it's never too cold. It's just a perfect temperature for them and you never move the refrigerator and it never moves. So they'll stay there 
um, incredibly long and just incredibly, um, you know, they don't have to go without, because they need moisture more than they need anything else. And so that condensation, and if some food is spilled on the side, then boom, they don't have to go much, much further at all. So I'm going to try, and I'm surprised because there's not a lot of roaches coming out right now. So I'm wondering if, uh, if I move this, will we see um, a lot? So let me, let me move it real quick. See them. They're crawling, hanging out, having a good time. You see all the roach feces. And so once I once I put a flushing agent down there, they're going to come out even more. So, but you can see right now there's even tons already, and just plenty of places for them to hide as well if they don't even want to go towards the inside. Oh wow. So, boom. See all of that? I don't know if it's in focus, but yeah. So, once I put a flushing agent, they're all going to freak out. But tons of adult German roaches. So, again, this is the most place where they hang out. So if you can get these areas in control in your kitchen, you can control and even eliminate the roach problem in your home. So again, this is the five worst places where you'll find roaches, I would say in your house. Um, of course, uh, honorable mentions would be in the bathroom because that's another water source. If you have a smaller refrigerator in a room, uh, if you have an air conditioner that has condensation really bad, um, uh, the microwave they love hanging out in the microwave is another good area um, uh, they'll hang out behind washer and dryers so but the five places that I mentioned the most are the the place you'll find them the most so again this is Tulsa Roach Exterminator and um, thanks again like share subscribe this channel will definitely help you get a rope if you are do it yourself this channel will definitely help you get rid of roaches so all right thanks guys